What's up, Ringside Collectibles, WrestlingFigs.com. Charlie Saxon here once again, San Diego Comic-Con, and I'm standing here with the one, the only, Big E. Big E, how you doing today, man? I'm good, man. How are you? Great to see you. How are you enjoying your con so far? Uh, it's been fun. It's been a lot of fun. I've had a signing at Mattel, and I got to see the uh, guys at Marvel. Uh, so it's been a lot of fun interacting with fans, and, and seeing the new Mattel stuff is really cool. Uh, I got to check out uh, my new figure. I think there's one with a gray singlet and another one with the uh, white singlet that I wore for my first WrestleMania, so it's pretty cool. Well, speaking of, let's check out that figure right now. Let's have it flying in. Bill from Mattel, we greatly appreciate you bringing it out to us. No Give us your thoughts on this new figure here, Biggie. I, I love it. I think they nailed the, the detail. Uh, also, it comes with the, uh, the IC title, which I love so dearly. Um, but uh, it's really cool for me. It was a special moment. It was my very first WrestleMania, the only time I've ever worn this singlet. Uh, so I, I, they nailed it. Uh, they made my, my thighs nice and thick, which, which I'm into. Uh, the, the constipated expression, which I've tried to master for years, uh, worked very hard on. They, they got that down to uh, the details. Uh, so it's really cool. Anytime you get to see a new figure, and honestly, to, to hold you know, a, a copy, a version of yourself in your hands and, and know that little kids uh, all around the world will have an opportunity to, to play with you is pretty cool. Now, when you were growing up as a lowercase e, did you collect action figures yourself? <laughs> yeah, when I was a lowercase e, I definitely did. Um, I remember being really young, and I had uh, I first started out with a hacksaw Jim Duggan and a uh, Jake the Snake in my old uh, WF ring. Uh, so yeah, I definitely did. That's great. Now I noticed you're starting quick fac a little faction with Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston. Give us a little quick. Uh, a little uh, summary on what's going on well, there? Well, uh, all we'll say is that things are uh, brewing, and uh, we won't divulge uh, much more information than that. But uh, uh, honestly, all, all three of us are very excited about the, uh, the future of what we have brewing. I, I think it'll be very good, and uh, we're excited to be doing something you know, uh, fresh and new. Cool. All right, one last question. Like you said, you're a big guy. You're pretty recognizable. Give me five disguises you would dress up as here at Comic-Con to make yourself incognito? Uh, definitely Wolverine. I was a big Wolverine fan as a kid. Uh, Apocalypse, I think. He was probably my favorite villain in the Marvel Universe. Um, I was a big Goldberg fan as a kid, but I don't know <laughs> if that really works. Might be hard to pull off. Yeah, <laughs> um, but let's let's go that, with that as a third. Right, third. Um, let's see, we need two more. Uh, I'm, I'm a fan of what uh, Dave's doing with, uh, you know, the uh, new Guardians movie. So I'll go as Drax for the fourth. And last but not least, uh, Poison Ivy. Don't ask me why. I won't, but those are all great choices. Big E, thank you so much, man. We really, greatly appreciate it, man. Thanks for having me. Enjoy the rest of your con. Thank you. Thank you.